Hey guys, this is Trisha, Head of Accounting at Pearl Lemon Group. And today, I'm gonna show you guys the following frequently asked questions and work tutorials that you need to know if you are a new accounting employee in the corporate world. Also, if you have questions or concerns, please feel free to comment in the comment section below and we will get back to you as soon as possible. So without further ado, let's start with the discussion. Hi, so in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to create a new invoice or actually add a new invoice when there is an existing client that, you know, paid their monthly payment or pay their monthly invoices similar in amount or whether or not but this will be um the easier method to use so for uh, first you need to go to free agent again then let me give you an example for okay talent spa let's see if this has and this had an invoice or not? Okay, there you go. See, on Feb 8, 2022, Talent Spa uh, had, had an invoice worth of 2,340. And for example, I will give them an invoice again for this current day, October 8th. Say October 8th. What you need to do is just go to the it's past invoice, then click this more, then duplicate invoice. So as you can see, all of the information of talent spa invoice is written all over here. So, okay, invoice represent, let's say October. This is for the payment of, for the month of October, okay. Invoice date is October 8th. Then payment days, pound sterling, of course, it's UK. Then additional tax, email. So they are paying through Stripe and yeah, we use free agent to collect payments through Stripe. So next, create new invoice. So there you go. Same amount but different date. You just need to click them duplicate invoice. Then once you are sure with this one, just mark as sent. Then it will be remain in this contact. Mark as sent. So there you go. So once you once you click contact again. Then T Talent Spa, you will see that they owe 2340 because of the invoice that was set to pay on October 8th. Yeah, that's all. This is the end of this video for now. I hope you gained knowledge, and if you like this kind of topics, please comment and hit the like, share, and subscribe button for more videos like this. This has been Trisha, the head of accounting at Berlamo Group. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.